Hello, welcome back to Growth Revolution and today I'm going to walk you through some simple steps that we use to acclimatize our PC plan with 99% survival rate. If you are interested in this kind of content, subscribe to our channel and if you have any comments or thought, feel free to write down your comments and I will get back to you as soon as possible. Alright, so let's get started. So first we have to prepare the water. So we have three containers of water that we will use to clean the, the pan and we have one container that filled with the iodized and we also have some simple tools such as a pair of scissors and we have serene, we have tweezers, we have brush and we also have tissues to dry the pan after we clean them okay so we also have a stone plastic container we have perlite, peat mod, and this is how it's gonna look like after we mix them together. We use 50% of peat mod and 50% of perlite. And this is also a container that we use, and there is also a pot inside our dome container. Okay, so this is an example that we uh, acclimatize our plant in one container. So we have many plants in it. And we also have one plant in one container which is the dome plastic cup but take a look at the pot inside we have a little pot inside that container if you don't have the peat mod you can also use the cocoa coin but make sure that it has been disinfected already okay we use the same ratio so 50% of perlite and 50% of the cocoa coin and this is our package so take a look at the gel or air guard it has been destroyed but the plant itself was not damaged or it could be a little bit damaged but you can still acclimatize this plan by following the instruction at the back of the package alright so now we're gonna mix the iodide with the water so we don't have exact amount of the of the iodide with the water so we just drop some drops of the iodide into the water that we have prepared so take a look at the color of the water it's gonna turn a little bit yellow so that means it is doable i mean it is good enough for the plants to you know to to disinfect the plant and then we're gonna cut the side of the package so inside this packet is gonna be another plastic container all right so just take it out And then we're gonna cut the top part of the container so just cut it off and then take the plant out of the container so while you are taking it out so we're gonna use the tweezer to take the plant out of the plastic container while taking it out so make sure that you try to get rid of the gel or agar in the plastic container all right so we're gonna drop it into our uh, water container and then we're gonna do the cleaning we're gonna trim it out trim the root out a little bit okay so don't worry about trimming the roots because uh, trimming them out is not a bad thing to do because it is encouraging the plants to regrow their roots so it's okay to trim them out and it's easier for you to clean the plants and also to put it in the soil mix or in the pot all right so just uh, clean the plants right now so we clean with the water use the brush to clean the plant so make sure that you don't have any agar or any gel left in the plants or the root of the plants because those kind of things can cause the plant to get root rot or stem rot all right, so just make sure that you clean them thoroughly or carefully. All right, so after cleaning the plant, I'm gonna drop it into our iodized solution. So you can leave it about one to three minutes inside the uh, in the solution so then you can take it to another 
clean water and then you clean it a little bit and then you're gonna dry it with the tissue okay so this is how it's gonna be all right so we clean it a little bit and then we dry the plant with the tissue All right now, so we're gonna put the plant into our pot, and this little pot gonna be put into our dome plastic container or dome plastic cup. So yeah, this is this is it. All right, so we're gonna spray a little bit of water into the pan. So make sure that you don't spray it too much. Okay. All right, so. That's about it. Then we're gonna put the little part inside our dome plastic container and cover the lid. And then you just check it out from time to time and spray some water if it looks a little bit dry. And you can put your plant into somewhere that it has enough light from the nature and from your lamp and make sure that it doesn't get really hot. All right, so now I'm gonna show you another one. This is alocasia so make sure that you deal with this one more gently and make sure that you use sharp pegs of scissors okay all right so we are trying to get the plant out of the plastic container all right so we're gonna use the tweezer again all right so we're gonna put it into the water again and then we're gonna do a little bit of trimming and cleaning so we're gonna trim a little bit of the root because this plant doesn't have that many roots so we try to keep some root to the plant all right so we use the brush to clean it again so make sure that you deal with it gently Then we're gonna soak it into iodized solution for about one to three minutes. Okay. And then we're gonna transfer it from the iodized solution to the water just to clean the plant from the solution. And then we're gonna dry it with the tissue again. Alright, so now we're gonna prepare our little pot. So we're gonna make a little hole in the middle of the pot. And then we're gonna take the pan and then put it inside the pot. Alright, so we're gonna secure it a little bit. Alright, so now we're gonna give it a little bit of water. Make sure that you don't offer water in the plant all right so just this much okay so we're gonna put it inside our dome plastic container or dome plastic cup and cover the lid all right so there's another one that we would like to show you so this one is from the a plastic container again but a different one not from the plastic one but from I mean not from the plastic bag but from the plastic container or plastic top something like this what I can say is that you just have to repeat the same step that you have seen from the beginning of the video and just do the same thing okay so you just trim a little bit of the root trim a little bit of the leaf that you can see kind of dead leaf or yellow leaf you just trim it out trim some root too and then clean the plant clean the root make sure that there's no gel or agar stick to the plant or the root of the plant okay
so now you can see that we use a different kind of container so for this container you can you know uh climatize many plants in it we normally climatize about five plants in it maybe 10 sometime if the plant is not too big okay but it's not suitable for the other cats actually but you know this kind of plant they grow so fast so maybe you can put it in the the tall one like the dome uh plastic container that one maybe even more suitable okay and just in case you don't have a lid or a cover for your container you can use the kitchen wrap to wrap the top part of your container it is also doable so just give it a try and you just have to change it again and again when you have to water the plant okay all right so that's about it for this video i hope you enjoyed this video and give it a thumbs up like and subscribe thank you see you in the next one